Real Madrid like Kai Havertz, but they will not pay that money. So at the moment, while I'm speaking, the Kai Havertz deal for Real Madrid is off. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Fabrizio Romano here, as always, to keep you posted on the transfer market, and today, guys, we mention Josko Gvardiol, because we have updates on this fantastic centre-back, but also many Chelsea fans asking about Christopher Kunku, what's going on with this signing, completed months ago, but why is not announced yet, should they worry about that, and also something about Kai Havertz and Real Madrid, we know Real Madrid are busy on the market this summer, and so, let's jump into it, together. <music> And guys, let me start with Kai Havertz because this is an important update we have on the German player. We know and we say that Real Madrid consider Havertz one of the players in their list. They want him because they consider him a very interesting player uh, in different positions, very versatile player. So very good skills for uh, Kai Havertz, really appreciated in particular by Carlo Ancelotti. But there is one thing I wanted to mention and this is something I got uh, over the weekend. Real Madrid internally and also together with Ancelotti, they feel that the asking price from Chelsea that is more than 60 million euros because it's 60 guaranteed plus a don'ts. So Chelsea want more than 60. It could be more than 70, including a don'ts. This is way too much. Real Madrid like high average, but they will not pay that money. So at the moment, while I'm speaking, the high average deal for Real Madrid is off because of this. They appreciate the player, but they're not prepared to pay that money. So this is the reality. At the moment, Havertz to Real Madrid is really complicated. If Chelsea will change their position on the money and on the price tag, this could change. But at the moment, looks really complicated to see Kai Havertz to Real Madrid. Looks really, really difficult and, while I'm speaking, is off. Then, guys, about Kai Havertz, Chelsea expect other clubs to join the race. Maybe some club from England, maybe some club from abroad, but Chelsea are sure that some other clubs will approach them for Kai Havertz. This is why they are asking for important money and not making any discount. Mentioning Chelsea, we know last summer they were close to signing Josko Gvardiol, then the deal collapsed at the final details. For Josko Gvardiol, let me mention again Manchester City. Man City are really, really serious for Josko Gvardiol again this summer. I already told you in February, March, Man City will be there for Gvardiol because they love him and they consider him a fantastic player and Pep Guardiola is a big fan of the player. Now, guys, we can say that Manchester City are restarting the contacts. I told you that they agreed personal terms with Matteo Kovacic, waiting for the conversation with Chelsea, but also Josko Gvardiol is on Manchester City list. Pep Guardiola is pushing to sign him and so... Keep an eye on Guardiol because Manchester City will be there this summer for him. It's not an easy negotiation because Leipzig want to make Guardiol the most expensive centre-back ever. More than 80 million euros, way more than this. So not an easy negotiation between clubs. The player would be keen on the move, but for Man City, he's a target. Guardiol is one of the players they 100% have on the list. And mentioning... Uh, Red Bull Group, and in this case, uh, Red Bull Leipzig. For Christopher Kunku, guys, uh, let me clarify one thing. No worries, Chelsea fans. The deal was completed in September when Kunku completed the medical test in September last year for Chelsea and then in December all the documents were signed. So Kunku is a Chelsea player, 100%. Why no announcement yet? Because they agreed, Chelsea and Leipzig, in December when they signed the documents that this was going to be announced after the final games of Kunku with the national team. This was an agreement to protect the club and the player from too many rumors. Then the news was leaked. This is part of our job. But uh, the deal will be announced after the national team games for Christopher Kunku. So this is the plan. Just wait a few days, probably after day 18, 19, we can wait for the official announcement or this could be beginning of July. But Christopher Kunku is Chelsea player for more than 60 million euros fee. And so guys, let me know your thoughts on this Christopher Kunku deal. Congrats to Chelsea. This is a very good one in my personal opinion. Josko Gvardiol, Man City, the best destination for him or maybe not. And then guys, remember to send in your comments also about Kai Havertz for Real Madrid. Do you think it's a good idea not to pay that money or is needed at Real Madrid? Let me know your thoughts guys here in the comments. Remember to like this video, turn on the notification bell, subscribe to the channel and see you soon with a mix.